it. A lot of people say that uh, unless you start young with, with performing music uh, from memory, it's difficult to start. Well, actually, I started after I, my education was gone, um, in my late 20s, actually. Uh, but since then, I have never done a recital with music since then. Um, I think I've become addicted to the danger of it, the adrenaline and the sense that you're taking a really big risk. And actually, one of the concepts that's very dear to my mind is that what you learn in life, I think, is in direct proportion to the risks that you take. So you take big risks, you learn big lessons. And then after years and years of playing from, uh, without the music in public, uh, it became the norm. It actually stopped being so risky anymore. Of course, you make mistakes here and there, but you don't judge your life by the mistakes you make. You judge your life by the heart you give uh, through music. Uh, when I met Alex, uh, the pianist, Alexander Schramm, uh, we decided to perform our recitals, both of us playing from memory. And that is raising the threshold, of, the danger th threshold even further, I think. Uh, it takes a long time to build up. But, uh, and it probably takes two, three performances of a piece for, for a piece to settle. But once it settles, it's unshakable. When you talk about memory, it's perceived, although it's not, it's perceived as an intellectual inter uh, exercise. Mm -hmm. um, it's much, much more deep than that. And of course, there are other aspects of music that are very important to balance out. Because there's actually also a, so, a negative side to memorizing. Because as you repeat and repeat and repeat, there's a danger that you become dead through repetition. So you have to balance the process of learning out between the discipline and strategizing and internalizing of the music while preserving the sense of connection with the moment, the sense of improvisation in music. So I'm a great believer in improvisation as well. That's, if you like, if I stand on two legs, those are my two legs, memory, and improvisation, musically speaking.